You gotta grind if you really want it. Don't hesitate. You came this far enough, finish out the whole dream. Nobody said it would be easy. What's up, to the gang? It's your girl, Tootie Grand, back with another video. And I am about to do a three year car review on my baby. Today makes three years. Oh my god. It literally feels like I just got her. If you want to see what my car is, I have a video three years ago. <laughs> Go check it out. But make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe, and let me just get straight to it. So for the ones that don't know, I have a 2013 Honda Civic and I call her Lani. That's my baby. Um, basically, I got her three years ago, of course. Um, best decision ever. <laughs> yes, I've had, you know, some ups and downs with her, but I mean, that's with any car. But do I regret getting it? Hell no. Best first car I've ever purchased in my life. <laughs> mm. Definitely wish it would have been, you know, in a better circumstance than it was when I had to get her. But I don't regret it at all. She, for the most part, has been very reliable. It's just, ugh. it's a great feeling knowing that you don't have to go through what you used to go through like the breakdowns the all the money spent putting in on cars oh my god Ugh. especially foreign cars and even older cars that's where a lot of the money is right there like getting all those parts fixed and they're so old and just, mm. if you know you know i ain't gotta go into detail but i definitely love getting her i know she's not new but She's new to me, and I love her so much. Um, do I recommend? I always would recommend a Honda. Um, it doesn't have to be a Civic. It could be a Accord. Honestly, I would recommend any foreign car. I mean, American cars are okay, too, just depending on what brand you get. But I would definitely do research on whatever car you're trying to get because there's so many, you know, manufacturer tidbits that go down. We all know if you been a car owner for a while you know what i'm talking about but i definitely would recommend a honda for the most part um the dealerships however <laughs> that's 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 another subject i'm not gonna get into that but i definitely would recommend a honda for sure um would i want something different at the time lonnie was not what i was wanting to get um i was at a total different dealership first of all i wouldn't even add a honda dealership at first um we were at ugh, i think it was a nissan dealership if i remember correctly i think we we're at a nissan dealership and first of all my mom's the one that went car shopping because you know <laughs> i didn't know shit about cars i just needed a vehicle and she had picked out a couple good ones and unfortunately the only ones they had available from her lineup were two of them the first one was a no-go she pulled up it was a toyota she pulled up and the brakes honey mm, that was a no-go even though you can fix the brakes that still just turned me off from the car i was just like yeah if you're showing me something i need to see impress me you know like don't just drive anything up here and just i oh, will fix it it should be fixed before you even try to bring it over here to me and the second one I think it was a Nissan. I don't remember which one, but I liked it. And unfortunately, I needed a co-signer and no one was available or able to do that. So that's where my problem was. It was, you know, we got good credit, but <laughs> not good enough to, you know, get this by yourself. So thank God my dad used to work at Honda and my mom works for a credit union. So I was able to get them together and came out with Lonnie, thanks to a loan from Keesler. And now I have my first car. I'm still running amazing. Not too happy about the 100,000 miles on it, but hey, it's a Honda, she'll last me, it's okay. <laughs> Any foreign car will last you, is that right? As long as you take care of it. Um, but I am hoping to pay her off 
I know I have another two years under contract with Heasley, but hopefully I can pay it off before that. Um, I definitely would want something else, but I'm not pushing the matter because she still has a long way to go. And she was a used car before I got her. She came all the way from Arkansas. Like, she's been through it. <laughs> like, the previous owner or owners, I don't even know how many owners there were, but she's been through it. <laughs> but she's still going because you got to understand, I got her at only 67,000 miles. Uh, 2013 and this was in 2018 when I got her so she was only five years old and she has 67,000 miles on her and now she's at I think 110 so I only put 40 I only did 40 in three almost three years that's not bad <laughs> you know, that's, that's not bad at all but I wouldn't trade her I wouldn't, not until I feel like she needs to be. My motto is I'm riding this thing to the wheels fall off and that's literally what I did with the previous car and this is what I'm gonna do with her. Unless I feel like I need an upgrade, which honestly, I'm always changing my mind. One minute I want a Camaro, next minute I want a Tesla, next I want a fucking there's so many I can't even keep up but just know if I ever do have to trade her in or give her up it'll be because of the fact that she's on her last leg or you know I just we gotta part ways but for the most part Lonnie has been amazing she has had a couple bumps in the road but you know what car doesn't but I definitely do not regret getting her she has been a lifesaver for the most part when she does break down and she has problems it can be a bitch <laughs> it can be a bitch but not like it was with the other car not at all and for the ones that didn't know what my old car was it was a 2001 mishi bishi galant my mom had it completely paid off so she gave it to me when it was time for me to start driving and let me tell you I've had some good times in that car, but for the most part, it, go, it was a headache because it would break down like every two to three months. <laughs> Put a lot of money into that vehicle. Wish I can get it back. <laughs> that was a lot of fucking money I went into that Mitsubishi, let me tell you. Mm. But like I said, I don't regret either car. I had transportation. I'm completely blessed to have that. Like I said, the first one was given to me. And the second one, <laughs> I just had to get because the first one, you know, gave up on me. So I was like, okay, can't be without vehicles. So by the grace of God, Honda and Kiesler were able to work together and get me into Lonnie. So it's been three years. Holy crap. It's so crazy. It doesn't feel like it's been three years. <laughs> like That should really be going by fast, y'all. Like, like, I feel like I just got her. <laughs> like... I remember the day I got her, I was super excited. Like, I was like, oh my God, like, had a newer car, y'all. Like, I was driving a 2001. Like, <laughs> that's a big difference from 2013 and 2001. That's a big difference. So, so I was very appreciative of that. But no, I would definitely recommend if you know anyone with a Honda Civic or you have a Honda Civic, you know what I'm talking about. They are very reliable for the most part. Um, <laughs> But like I said, you know, when they, when they start tripping, you you already know. I, I ain't got to go into it. And for the ones that like to talk about us Honda Civic drivers, let me tell you. Stop coming for us. Because it's not all of us that drive crazy, okay? It's just the certain ones that drive crazy with their Honda Civics. I'm just going to put that out there. It ain't all of us. So, 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 don't. Who the fuck is we? I ain't doing that shit. She ain't talking about me, but <laughs> I'm going to just leave that off with that. Ugh. Hopefully she's still here for year five so I can do a year five review. Because, like I said, she'll definitely be paid off by then, hopefully. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Um, but hopefully I can continue to have her for another two years to where I can do a five-year 
review on her and I can see the progress and what she's been through because whew, three years is a long time. Can't believe it flew by that fast. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Wow. That's crazy. Hmm. These years are going by fast. I'm not liking it, but it's you gang. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was a requested video and I even was like, you know what? Why not do it? Y'all were with me when I got her. <laughs> so why not do a little update on her? Um, eventually, I'll get her exactly how I want her and I'll do a full flood Lonnie vlog so you guys can see the inside, the outside, everything. Um, I mean, you've seen the basics when I got her, but you haven't seen what I've done to her since then. But once I get her exactly how I want her, I promise you guys will get to see that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna sign off. And Sweetie Gang, thank you guys so much for watching this. I don't know if this is interesting for y'all, but <laughs> it's interesting to see how far I've come with her in three years. That's, mm, love it. But Sweetie Gang, I'll see you guys next time.